Hey guys! Um, so the line's kind of long at Starbucks, so I'm gonna take advantage of that. And I'm gonna come on here and just give you guys a quick update of what I've been doing. So I haven't been doing much. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, so I just went to the uh, dry cleaners and I dropped off my dress blues, which is the army is like our, I don't know, like our professional uniform, like for memorials and like board boards and stuff. And when we graduate, like schools. So I just dropped mine off. I'm going to the promotion board for sergeant because I'm a specialist right now on Tuesday. So I'm super excited. I'm not that nervous. I was nervous at first, but um, it's going to be over Microsoft Teams. Microsoft Teams is like this virtual, like, um, well, you probably know what it is. It's kind of like Zoom. And it's going to be over that. So it should be pretty chill. But I still have to dress up in my uniform and... Yeah, so I went to go drop it off to get my new rank sewn on and then also to get it dry cleaned. But today I'm at Starbucks because we're going to try the new eggnog. Well, they're not new. I think I didn't know about them, but apparently it's a holiday drink as well. And they have eggnog latte and eggnog cream wraps. So that's what we're going to be trying today. How are you doing? Hello, pretty good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you for asking. What can get started for you? Can I do a grande um, eggnog cream frap? Okay. But instead of non-fat milk, can I just do eggnog? So you want no, uncut eggnog? No non-fat milk, just eggnog. Yep, so uncut. Yeah. All right, anything else? And then can I do an eggnog latte, but iced? What's iced? Grande. Okay. And that'll be it. So I have a grande uncut eggnog cream frappuccino and a grande iced eggnog latte. Yes. Perfect. We'll see you down for 11.54. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you. I'm not eccentric. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. That's somebody's license plate in front of me. I don't know what the fuck that means. But anyways, I look kind of dry today because I am dry. Like my phone. I'm dry because I didn't put lotion on after I showered, and nor did I put like any type of moisturizer, nor did I put chapstick. I just showered and I left my house like a dumbass. I just, at least I put my contacts in. It's happened where I sit in my car and I'm like, oh shit, I can't see, and I have to go inside and put my contacts on. But anyways, yes, I'm super excited. Let me see, did I even bring my debit card? Oh yeah, I did because I paid over. But, um... I'm excited. Um, I don't know what the army is going to be for me. Um, like my future though. Like I don't know if I'm staying in or getting out or if I'm dropping an OCS packet or I don't know. But I'm doing school right now. So also if you're in the army, you probably know basic leaders course BLC is online. So like I'm taking advantage of the fact that everything's online. My board is online and my school for to be e, an E5 is online, BLC, like basic leaders course. So it's kind of lit. Although also I have my midterm for my stats class coming up and I don't know what the fuck is going on in that class, but I'm passing. I have a high B, a high B, a low A, I like 90%, I think. So I'm super excited for that. Um, bio is, whatever the teacher i had him for nutrition last semester and he the professor sorry i had him for last for my last class for nutrition and he grades his grading curve is like off the wall like i'll turn in an assignment like a study guide which is like basically like um before our quiz we have a study guide and we turn it in for 15 points i'll turn in the same thing twice but like different info but the same format and i'll be graded like 15 on one and the next one's like a nine and i'm like it's literally the same format. I use the same thing. All I did was change the words. So I don't understand where he, like his rubric, he has no rubric on Canvas. I don't understand how he grades. And it stresses me out so much. But the thing that I do like about him is that he will leave comments on the assignment and let us know what we did wrong. And that way we can correct it and like put like, just correct and turn it in again. Even though it's late, he'll accept it and he'll give us full credit. So that's what I do like. So it's whatever though. But yeah, also I've been watching the state. Um, my mom flew in on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I didn't vlog. 
But I did post a lot of pictures. So if you want to see pictures of that, go to my Instagram. Also, follow me on Snapchat and you'll have like daily updates of what I do with my life every day. And yeah, so that's basically what I've been up to. Other than that, um, I'm going to go grocery shopping after this. And I also have to go to Target to pick up some trash bags. And um, so, you know, <laughs> my friend's moving to Arizona. My best friend's moving to Arizona next week. So she's moving and I lived with her for a while. So I have to go get my uh, bed frame and take it apart. And you guys know that little L-shaped like hex tool? I didn't know what it was called. I literally had a Google L-shaped tool. So I have to go buy one of those right now. And then tomorrow we're gonna take that apart and then her movers come on Tuesday. So I'm probably gonna throw that bed frame away, which is sad because it's like brand new, but it's whatever. Also, Washington State is back to red like hello did you want to see no it's okay got it it is for that cappuccino awesome you can call it out thank you did you want to stop oh no 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 you want a strawberry? Yes, please. Thank you. Pretty good. I went to run some errands and I'm gonna go grocery shopping in a bit. I ran so many errands today. I'm like, oh, I did so many errands. I got out to work and I'm like, oh, is it afternoon already? Where am I? This is really weird. Yeah. Like, up to 6 a.m. Oh my god, I don't wake up that early. I just woke up literally like at 12. I wish I could. Uh, sometimes I wake up at 12, but today for some reason on a Saturday of all days. Yeah. I'm like, how about we go, wake up at 6? I'm like, how about no? <laughs> but I still wake up anyway, so I'm like, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so Awesome, thank you. You too, have a good day. I might as well keep my mask on because my face is dry. Let me just park somewhere. Ooh, that light window. I don't know where the hell I'm gonna park. I don't wanna park somewhere where people can see me. Oh shit, there's people here like fixing their car or something. <gasps> I'm gonna park over here. Sorry. Okay. Awesome. So these are the two drinks I got. I got the eggnog, eggnog latte. And the uh, Grande Eggnog Cream Frap. But I had replaced non fat milk, so I saw it online on the app. So I switched out the non fat milk for um, regular eggnog. It just made sense. Like, I, I don't really drink milk, so I'd rather do it with eggnog, you know? So let's get our straws. Oh, shit. You know what song has been in my head? That's why I was like humming it or like. Um, China. I don't know who sings it. It's like reggaeton music, but um, I'm excited. Okay, I'm gonna try the latte first. Or actually, yeah, I'm gonna try the latte first because it's. It tastes like a regular latte, just coffee and. It just tastes like iced coffee. It 
It tastes like iced coffee. Oh. Okay. Let's try this one. Mmm. That shit is thick. Bomb. So switch, definitely, if you get the eggnog cream, switch it out for um, eggnog, the regular milk. It tastes like rompope. Like, if you're Latin, you know what rompope is. Like, a rompope raspado, that's what it tastes like. I was addicted to rompope growing up. Except the ice cream bars that had, like, rompope, but they had raisins in them. Oh, heck no. I love to take off the lid. Mm. They put nutmeg and whip on top. Mmm. That shit is bomb. I should do one of those got milk ads. It's bomb. Oh, I have brain freeze. That shit is so bomb. That's exactly what I needed. Like, eggnog, that's what I wanted. This one tastes like iced coffee. Like, it doesn't even taste like eggnog. That's why um the eggnog frap from Starbucks has coffee in it. But the eggnog cream... It's basically just like cream and eggnog. That's why I asked for instead of milk, I wanted eggnog because it was double eggnog. Bomb. I love coffee, but. That's whatever. This is the one that I like. Thriving. Living my best life. I literally woke up today at 3 p.m. Not even like 2. At 2 p.m. And I ate grapes. And I faced, well, Jade had faced me. So it was fun. And this is my second meal of the day. This is so good. Ten out of ten. But get the eggnog instead of milk. This is whatever. I 
All right, y'all. So I'm gonna leave it there. Also, Washington State is back to, um, I don't know what's here, whatever. Like it's on lockdown again or whatever. So California's on purple tier. That's what I know. But I'll be flying home for the holidays. So I'm super excited for that. December 13th or 18th to January 3rd. And then Thanksgiving, I'll probably spend it with my friends. So yeah, blessings to everyone. And probably the only people that watch these videos are like my siblings. So hey guys, I love you guys. And everyone else who watches the video, make sure to subscribe. I'm probably, I saw that Shake Shack has uh, the cookie cutter or cookie cluster. <laughs> Um, shake, so I'm probably gonna go try that. I had Shake Shack for the first time uh, last weekend when my mom flew in. We went to, well, we door dashed Shake Shack to the hotel, and it was amazing. It was a very opening experience. I think Shake Shack might be better than In N Out. Also, the cheese fries, oh my god, bomb! But I'll probably do that tomorrow or next weekend. I don't know yet, I have a busy schedule with school and all so we'll see that but have a good day guys or good night or whenever you're watching this and take care bye